Greetings all, it's the 5th of February 2022, and we're looking at Tropical Cyclone Batsarai. It has been an impressive storm for many days, reaching major hurricane intensity and bringing extremely high rain totals to Reunion Island already, and brought storm surge into Mauritius. Here we'll check out the forecast as the storm is currently making landfall on Madagascar. Here is the latest satellite loop from the storm from Meteosat 8. Remember the storm is rotating anticyclonically because it's the southern hemisphere. It's just offshore at the moment. This is one hour out of date. It's currently around approaching 11 UTC here in the UK. You can see some drying of air on this side of the storm as the air flows off the island and off the mountainous terrain. This interaction with the island has produced a slight weakening from yesterday, but the storm remains still quite impressive with a quite symmetrical structure in the core as it approaches land. Let's take a look at the Hurricane Wharf. Here you can see the storm being initialized at around 100 knots, making it a Category 3 hurricane strength system. The storm in this model makes landfall around Category 2 or 3 on the Saffir Simpson scale. You can see the stronger winds on the southern side of the eye wall. The storm then weakens as it crosses Madagascar and the pressure rises. This is the latest model run that only goes to this point. So if we look at a previous one, we'll see the extended prediction that takes a storm out into the southern Mozambique channel before turning it to the south and re-intensifying it to tropical storm strength. And then eventually this broader circulation heads to cooler waters and weakens. And if we check out some other models, you'll see the uh, track is quite consistent in the other models too, taking that turn down to the south, which thankfully takes a storm away from land and future impacts. Earlier we had some nice satellite images of the storm. This one was from yesterday. It's a flyover using the Sentinel-3 imagery from yesterday morning. And this one is a view from Meteosat as the storm at major hurricane intensity yesterday. This one shows an earlier loop when there was extreme rainfall over Reunion Note the strong northeasterly flow which will have hit the island volcanic mountains which rise to over 3,000 meters generating incredible rainfall. Reunion is the record holder for some of the rain rocket records over 12 to 72 hours. I can't remember offhand the specific records but it holds them because of situations like this where a tropical cyclone moves very closely and slowly close by the island. So now the storm will be heading across Madagascar over the next 48 hours and you'll see that weakening as it does so as the ocean energy is cut off over the island and more especially due to the major disruptive impact from the Madagascan mountains. Extremely high rain in the mountains should be expected with high flash flooding and landslide potential. The current forecast then indicates the storm emerging over the southern Mozambique channel and then moving towards the cooler waters as we saw with the hurricane wharf over the next few days. As we wrap up this video, I'm looking at the very latest satellite imagery and there isn't really clear signs that the weakening due to topographic interaction is having a major impact on the intensity of the storm and it still looks very, very powerful. Potentially, it does look like a major hurricane strength landfall is possible now. And we're looking at very severe impacts on this section of coastline on that southern side of the eye, as mentioned earlier. Satellite estimates still indicate the storm is Category 3 intensity, so very serious damage from surge and winds is expected. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.